right, here we go with round one. And DC, I know you have said to anyone within earshot, if you like grappling, this is the matchup for you. This is the matchup for you. You may as well be in a gymnasium somewhere watching a jiu-jitsu right, or a right. combat sambo competition because these guys are trying to both get the fight to the floor and they're trying to get bragging rights because no one has the accomplishments of these two in the grappling realm. So if one of them can secure a submission, it only will add to their legacy inside of the grappling world. And of course, if you're someone who likes the striking game, uh, maybe you'll like our next fight. Yes. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Couple of shins here being tested early. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. What a fantastic wrestler. Great takedown. Goes upstairs for an elbow. And they both stand up. That knee might have landed there. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. you got to slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Takedown defense holds up. Switching stances here. A oh, little single collar tie there. And there comes the separation now. Big kick. Just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Rafael Dos Anjos. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying oh, active. Oh, he's gonna slam him, DC! Oh, man, he got that Whoa. single leg. He got that single leg. He lifted him in the air and put him down. He's gonna try to take him down. There you go. Oh, ow. Slams him to the canvas with authority. Anjos gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Liver kick. Just over two minutes, round one. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Rafael Dos Anjos. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. He is all about that left kick to the body. Medov gets caught with that punch. What a body kick. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too. Because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, you come high kicking. Then you're in a lot of trouble. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. He'll engage in a single collar tie, and they separate. Great punch. And he lands the knee to the body now. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, nice hook by him there. How many times can this young man land this particular punch? RDA gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Oh, a huge block there. Missed with that attempt. That knee. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. And they separate. He loaded up there on that high kick. Final seconds of round one. Oh, and there's
There's a takedown attempt, not a great entry there. Not entertaining scrap so far. All right, so the takedown's the big storyline in that previous round. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and gotta be pretty discouraging to get grounded that many times in one round. Oh, it's so discouraging because all you want to do is let your offense go, but every time you're getting dragged to the floor constantly, you're starting to get fatigued. He's starting to wear on you. Let's see what the next round start. Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Rafael Dos Anjos. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. I'm going to follow this one. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Oh, oh big knee. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. And he comes through with a big knee. Oh, he lands another huge knee. How much more can he take? Knee to the body. Another nice knee there. That one home. Knee to the body. Big kick land. And now he's got that tie. Hip tosses we'll see him what down. Now we'll see if he can advance position. I mean, right into side control. Gets up again here, but hurting. Crippling knee to the body. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. And they separate. All right, so 77 total strikes have now landed for Rafael Dos Anjos. And in terms of the accuracy... Oh, oh, big knee. oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, he may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's gotta be confident that it's going to land, and he's gotta really throw his whole entire body into this try. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, he tosses, he takes him down. Now we'll see what he can do with it. Right into side control. All right, he's sort of hanging out here, unguarded DC. Not sure if he's trying to bait him in or what, but not great body language here. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hit him. Now starting to show signs of swelling. Reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom fighter. Both fighters back to their feet now. Oh, massive slam. That'll change the complexion of this one. Gomedov gets up. He is back on the feet here. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Double leg shot. Oh, slams his opponent to the ground. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold. And it's allowing him to really control. There's a song there, right? No when to hold him. No when to hold him. Yep, absolutely. Battling for hooks. Oh, huge knee to the head. Oh! 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 Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. So he 
Warriors really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll. Oh, this oh, goes on. No. Put up the sweep. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. All right, half guard position for him here, and I can hear Dominic Cruz in the back of my head just screaming about underhook somewhere. Yeah, somewhere. he loved I mean, but he's right, right? He's so right. Yeah, and that's going to do it. 13 steps in. Unbelievable result here tonight. Just before the end of that round, a huge shot that drops his opponent and ultimately spells the end of the fight. Referee jumps in there furiously to stop the fight. That is a...